back again and we're just going to get this going with Julie and there's a question and answer on here now so Yay. the comment tracker and a whole bunch of stuff so I've tweeted it out I put it on Facebook and um, we'll share as much as we can and we'll I think you're gonna cook a pie now yes. double header <laughs> okay Julie just have to adjust it to where you want Oh, I can see the pie plate, so. I was watching you when I was at my meeting. Over oh, yeah. oh, you? <laughs> Between the meeting. Are we back? Okay. Are we on? You're live. Hey, Up higher, okay. lower? Where do you want to go? Is everyone gone now? Yeah, Zero we're, viewers. Yeah, we've got to get them back yeah. on again. Okay, you tell me where you want okay, is to it, Is it on Google Plus? Uh, yes. Or on YouTube? Which is the better link? Uh, YouTube shows it directly, but I think you have to be in Google Plus to do it. So I've got to go into Google Plus here. Yeah. Yeah, zero viewers. I'm going to get back on again. Do you want a coffee, Mike? Oh, yeah, do you want a coffee? Are you sure? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, yummy. Oh man. Can't see them. We need to tilt it down a little bit. Much more. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Let me. <clears throat> going, going, and let's get, pull it back a little bit. I think that's the okay. difference. It's like just a little. Better? Yeah, perfect. And then if you lift it up a bit. Oh, man. Just right now it's cutting off right here. Up there you go. Just the perfect. Perfect. I'm going to plug her back in. Next thing we know, we'll go, we'll go dead. Okay, One we'll viewer! Go. Yay! What person's back? I don't know who it is. My sweetheart. Try. Okay, so apparently there's a co a comment tracker now. Oh, cool. So whoever's watching, see if you can ask a question. You're a guinea pig. I don't know who it is, but it so there's one viewer. And you know it's probably no, it's not any of us. No, because I'm trying to get on mine. Scones are out, biscuits, whatever you want. Can't really Let's see any comments yet. Do you have a Google account? You don't. Okay. Do you want to do it? Oh, this one. Set up. That's that's the one. Great. And I think I'm having problems because I'm more of a little That's it. Sure. 
I'll tweet it. Any Google Plus people? I'm a newer. Hmm. Oh, good. Amy's on. She said it's much clearer now. Oh, good. You know Amy? Don't see a Q&A window, though. No. Oh. Thanks, Amy. Biscuits are done. Mm -hmm. huh. mm -hmm. The app is on there. Yeah. Well, we'll figure it out. Oh, you want it to, Mike? No, because we have to set them up as a Google Plus. Making cranberries is getting so it's so festive in here. Well, we can put it on Twitter and ask people to ask that way. Then we can use both. Yep. Let's do that. And we're on Facebook. I'll put it on Facebook. And I put it on Twitter. Oh, two viewers. Yay. Is that Mike? <laughs> Probably. I've been kind of half doing my pastry and not sticking business. Pay attention to other things. Okay, well, I'm glad the sound is better. Um, I made the cranberry sauce. I just went ahead and started making everything for this weekend because <laughs> since I have no kitchen. Oh, so I keep seeing your your texts or whatever. Oh, they keep like, oh, sure my oh, stuff. No, no, it's okay. Side. It's totally fine. You're getting complimented a lot, though, just so you know. <laughs> okay. So I'll continue with the um, pumpkin pie. We found a pie plate and a rolling pin. Yay! Pastry is very warm. So you can watch it right on my phone. You're watching your phone? Mm -hmm. So I'm not sure why. I'm not sure what it's. No, I got it on everywhere now. Uh, and so it's on YouTube and Google Plus? Yep. You're everywhere, and you can log on. There's only one viewer, but Amy says she's watching, and you're watching. It might not. Yeah, it might, might not be, be accurate. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what's my like? What I shouldn't believe what I see on the internet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Pastry. In. It's all flaky in the bottom. That's okay. I put it in the fridge. Mix the filling. Well, I'm glad I have my crack tech team here. Okay, my other friend said the sound is excellent. Oh, good. Okay, two viewers, it says now. Yay, two viewers. Have they seen the biscuits yet? Do, 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 do. You gonna hear please stand by message? Are you? Are you trying to set, set up a? But you're well, in real time I mean, here. See, I mean, look, you can actually reach cool. out. Oh, good. Can you watch it on the screen and then reach out and see your own hand grabbing a sun? There, no, there's it's our... delayed, right? <laughs> oh, right. Of course, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's forget. I love biscuits. Oh. Especially with butter. Hmm. <sighs> we should flip the ducker down. Mm-hmm. I can miss it some more. Should have brought some of that crab apple jam. Oh yeah, there's no jam here. That's okay. No, I just made some. But then I couldn't bake biscuits at home because mm Hmm. Mm -hmm. I complain about having a thick waist, but one person asked the question. Oh, yay! Says no 
or smell o vision Oh, that was Melavision. That's that you? That's my Are friend. You? But I can't see it. So now I don't know how Julie would. Yeah, why are you seeing it and not, we're not seeing it. Maybe because we're recording. But how are you supposed to? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, you're going to in there. Let's make some pumpkin pie. Really. I only make this once a year. Oh, yeah. We don't do it at Christmas. Ah. Only at Thanksgiving. Oh. And only because my sisters want it. I think. Hmm. Is it on YouTube, the question? No, this is on Google. Yeah, I'm on Google. Um, hmm. When you see something earlier, I think that she was going to answer questions. I think you'd have to physically type it. There's a mm -hmm. yeah, there's oh, one, I know one of the ones for say you could ask before. So that's one of the things we want to do before. Mm -hmm. But I think you're going to hang out people, like on the yeah. demo and stuff. They have people hanging out with a lot of them being part of it, too. So I'm just, oh. miss, I'm just missing part of it. Great. So can you get him to help you? Right, yeah. like, the dog or like, <laughs> I couldn't get him to ask me a question. Oh. Yeah. Well, I'm going to Well, that's part of that. Oh, we gotta see the duck. This is so good. You guys are needing that. What's that? Duck sniffler. Because mm -hmm. you're not eating them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we do. So, this is Mike. I made the most. Oh, new message. Julie's married to an old hippie. <laughs> so it's great. easy to ask questions. Don't get jealous, like, ladies. We can't figure out. Can't figure so out. I made the most basic possible cranberry sauce: bag of cranberries, a cup of sugar, a cup of water, the zest and juice of an orange. Because every time I stray from it and make like balsamic and Concord grape cranberry sauce or whatever. Everyone complains. And yeah, they only eat the classic straight up cranberry sauce. So cranberries have tons of pectin in them, so you can just if it's Amy that I'm talking to, I'm gonna feel very stupid for saying that. Um, because she's perfect. So you just simmer it until they pop and then um, it turns into sauce. It's like super good. I'm trying to piece up we need to flip the duck. She has to flip the duck. It's my hand hugging. <laughs> Claudette's hand and, and bling. I yeah. saw that. Oh, here we go. I'm really bad for not oh using. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Mm hmm. Wow. Can you even hear it? Where's my okay. So this is gonna be a batch of duck fat fries later on. Or roast potatoes. Look how much fat though, like a cup comes off of every, every duck. Sorry, I'm totally like burping like cook. Good thing there's only two people watching. <laughs> <laughs> so flip it again. <clears throat> Look how crispy it's getting now. Hmm. Still has a ways to go. Did you get the duck at co-op too? Yes, co-op contributed it all the. They just gave me a gift card and let me go shopping, oh. which is awesome. Um. <clears throat> so yeah, they have fresh duck. That's so I figured head. while the turkey was cooking. <laughs> I would do a duck because people are curious about it, you know. Duck curious. curious. They're duck. They're duck curious. Hashtag duck curious. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Anyone watching this, use that so I can tell that you're watching. Duck curious. Okay. 
Now, I have to pull up my recipe on my laptop for pumpkin pie because I only make it once a year. I don't really like it. I, can't, I don't know. I don't, I don't dislike it as strongly as I used to. Really, it's just a vehicle for whipped cream, which in my books totally counts. Okay. Lost my spatula. Mm -hmm. Um, you got a special break. I love how this kitchen has like eighteen ovens and one special. <laughs> You'll be pleased to know the first one was seen by 386 people on Facebook. Read 11 already on part two. Wow. And I'm sharing her up. Good, good. I'll just keep freshing so I can see at least see comments on Facebook. They should not be in front of me. What's my friend say? Seriously. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we need um, pumpkin. Don't worry, my recipe. Up. Alex, hi. Say hi to Chris. I'm glad you think it's amazing. Chris and Diane. Chris and Diane. Hi. Chris is a cook. Too. Chris is a cook. Okay, so you're saying there should be questions somewhere. Sorry, yeah, there should be questions. I Thanks know. for being my guinea pigs. I've been thinking this would be a fun thing to do for years. And once we work the kinks out, it totally will be fun, I think. I mean, it's still fun. It's, I'm having fun anyway. Okay, I'm just pulling out my pumpkin pie recipe. It's like pumpkin and cream <gasps> and brown sugar. Oh! <gasps> oh! Oh, credits. No, hang on. Oh, no. no. We got super Sorry, we got excited. We Wrong thought thing. that there was a chat going on, but there's not. Um, okay, so you need one can of pumpkin, uh, just a 14 ounce, 398 mil, which is half of one of these. So this will make two pies. I did not think of that when I made the pastry and double my pastry. I just made a single pastry. And so we're gonna have one pie. So half of this, very accurately measured, of course. There, half um, sugar, white and brown. You know what? My, my Grammy is to do this. Hmm? Is that so? Do that we don't people enjoy them. vanilla? Sorry, whoever that is. I don't know what I turned on. Sorry, my head peeping in. I like using half brown and half white sugar. A cup in total. I'm making me that brown sugar over there. And I like using darker brown sugar, so I'm totally cutting my eyes off. Can you tilt it up just a little bit? Sorry? I tilted it down to see the scones, which are way more important than me. Okay. Perfect. Um, I like using darker brown sugar because there's more molasses in it, so you get that molasses flavor. Or you could add a little drizzle of molasses, if you like that. I'm not a black licorice fan, so kind of by default I'm not really a molasses fan, although I will eat a ginger cookie. And three eggs. This is the easiest pie. Like if you're a beginning pie maker, which I know a lot of you are not, <laughs> um, it's one of the easiest ones that you could possibly make. So the sugar kind of dissolves in the pumpkin, especially any lumps of brown sugar. And then a lot of recipes call for evaporated milk. <laughs> I love. Please don't mind what we're doing. Quadrant of planets. <laughs> Good thing we're having fun. Looking confused. Peeking in um, on us. Oh, you just reversed me. I know, sorry. Just it's so like, fun. oh, weird. Sorry, we reversed you. Which is like, so now I look kind of backwards. Because you know, when you see a picture of yourself, you think you look weird, right? It's because you only ever see a reflection. You don't see, you never see yourself from the perspective of other people unless you watch yourself on TV, which I never do. 
<clears throat> and most people aren't symmetrical. So hey, but you ever see somebody in the bathroom mirror, like if your husband was standing beside you and you look at his reflection and he's all like bent. <laughs> bent. Well, look, Jerome's is spelled properly now. It was bad. Right. It's beautiful. Oh, good. We're getting I did out. not notice that. All the times I was like, and um, we're keeping I you back. Okay, so I'm gonna get some cream. So we don't have a, don't have a team of cameramen to follow me when I go get, get the cream. <laughs> oh, just, you just like rotate the, eye, the laptop. Should put it on a lazy susan and just like spin. Oh, the next one. A lot of recipes call for evaporated milk, which is fine, but I never have. Like, who keeps evaporated milk anymore? Um, some people do, That's and if you do, that's great. I just don't. I always have cream, though, either half and half, or whipping cream, or coffee cream, which is sort of in between the two, and any of them will work. Um, so we need three quarters of a cup and three eggs. They're also in the fridge. Ah! Oh. Okay, ready for this? Huh? Did you catch that? that looks, what? Oh, okay, here's the question. How big of a turkey should I buy for 10 people? As big as you can possibly get. It's usually like half a pound per person. Because there's you have the white the skin and the bones and stuff like that. So would you it say depends on if you want leftovers or not. If so I wanted people, leftovers, would you say 15 pounds? Then? I would say yeah, 15, 18 pound. Er. Okay. Yeah. But nobody ever eats as much as they say. But no one ever, yeah, this is true. It's true. And then you can make sock and you can have chicken. Tur Depends on if you like pie. having leftovers, yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah, because this question. one we have in the oven was with, who asked us uh, to know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Somebody, no. somebody posted it. That's awesome. We wanted to have questions. I'm so excited. I don't know if I answered that very well. No. Honestly, I would never 15, do that. Yeah. I would yeah. say 15 pounds. Anyway. Yeah. I would say. For 10. Yeah, I would say 15 okay. pounds. Then you would have leftovers. Pounder. Okay. You might even not have leftovers because, you know, you have the, the weight of the, the carcass and the skin. 15 you know, for the, sure. And it's going to, it, it shrinks when it's cooking, right? You don't yeah. you start with a 15 pound trick. You don't wind up with 15 pounds with meat. <clears throat> Eggs, cream, and spices. Oh, I know. Cinnamon. Some ginger and cinnamon. <clears throat> I do like using fresh ginger, but I also like dry ginger, which is kind of peppery. I usually use both. Just as a different flavor from the fresh ginger, which I forgot at first. Cinnamon, because this was like an afterthought. Hey, we should make a pie. <laughs> Last time I was here, I just rooted through the cupboards and came up with stuff to make. Uh, a whisk works really well for this. It's kind of less sloppy. But spatulas are the best for stirring batter and dough because you can scrape the sides of the bowl. There is a whisk. I usually put some nutmeg in, some allspice, a little bit of cloves, but I find people don't typically like a lot of cloves. Kind of reminds them of going to the dentist or something. Lots of cinnamon. People are looking at the dishwashers behind mm. behind you. Ta -da. Super easy. That's it. All you have to do is whisk it together and pour it in the crust. Which I have not yet crimped. I usually trim it with scissors, but I don't see scissors here. Scissors? It's okay, or a knife. I keep losing my knives. And all there are left are ginormous knives. 
Or I could just pull it off. It'll be more rustic that way. Oh, yeah, totally. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that was my duck knife, yes. I'm just checking to see if this question's on. Oh, another question. Yes. From Alicia. Yeah. What's the best way to defrost a turkey? Oh, this is a contentious issue. Depends on who you ask. I I would suggest doing it in a, like a, a tub of water. A lot of people say that you should take it take it out of the freezer and put it in the um, in the fridge. But it takes forever to thaw in the fridge. It takes days to thaw in the fridge. So by the time the middle is thawed, that was I've been thawed for like three days, and I just don't like that. So I take it out. I think I take it out and put it in the sink. This is what I do. The sink is necessarily the right way. In case food police are watching, um, I put it in the sink and let it thaw uh, in the sink because it's really essentially the even the, the part that's thawed is on ice, right? The core is solid ice. So as long as it's cold, you know, it's like, and it's ice cold because the middle is frozen solid, um, it's okay. You don't want it to be at room temperature. Um, but you can, you can speed things up by, by putting it in a big tub of, of water or filling your sink with water, depending on how, we don't have a very deep sink. So if you can fill your sink with water or with this turkey that we did today, I put it in one of those um, just big green bins and covered it with water in the bathtub. Oh, which is currently our sink. That's where we do our logistics. And, and just covered it with water. And, and they suggest using cool water. Um, if you fill it with warm water and it's a, you know, 15 pound block of ice, it's going to cool down the water pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. So in winters, they say, let me pull up their website. They have like a specific time uh, to thaw your turkey. Winterstrickies.ca. Um, they're the people out in Down Me that I was talking about earlier who are, who have been raising turkeys forever and um, they're very knowledgeable so they've got like basic cooking times which is about 15 minutes per pound 30 minutes per kilogram at 325 I just realized I didn't turn the oven down on my turkey but this is what happens um, and it doesn't really matter what was I looking at oh yes how to thaw your turkey yeah. and so they've just got a, a, a time a per pound um, to thaw where is it Okay, following the turkey. Yes, fast method. Place wrapped frozen turkey in a sink or large container, cover, cover completely with cold water, allow one hour per pound of turkey, two hours per kilogram. Regular method, place it on a pan in the refrigerator, allow five hours per pound, it'll take four days to thaw. See, that's what I don't like, because by the time it's thawed, the outside has been thawed for four days, and I just, so I prefer just doing it in the sink or in a tub of water. That was a really long answer. But, um, yeah, people will say it's, it's only safe to do it in the fridge. But as long as it's cold, it's on ice. Okay. Yeah, do you want to do that? Yeah. Sure. Mike's going to pick up a little. Yep. So we'll drop him off the guitar and then come back here and we'll go back. And, yeah, it won't take an hour to get back. Yeah. He's got guitar at 4.30 till 5.30. So she's cooking a pie now. I'm making a pie. Some water for you too. Thank you. Just trimming the extra at the edge. Thanks, Mike. I wish the questions were popping up on the screen. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, we'll figure it out. All right, see ya. And then, yeah, crimp the edge however you like. This is just how my grandmother always crimped it. Between her two fingers. Oh, I've seen those, yeah. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Any questions? I'm a fly expert, so. Oh, no. <laughs> Do you want to come crimp this for me? No. Really? What's your special pie secret? Do you have any? Well, no, yeah. don't yeah. overrule it. Yeah, be gentle. Yeah, we don't need to mix it too much. Because yeah. once the flour 
that's why I'm not telling you until <laughs> the live feed. Yeah. Once the flower comes into contact with water, and a stir, it develops gluten, right? Which is why you don't want to overhandle your dough. Oh, that's what stirs up the gluten. And that's what makes, mm -hmm. like when you knead your yeast dough, that's what makes it kind of oh. elastic and chewy. And you want to try it. What is that? Oh, oh it's just a biscuit. A biscuit? Cream biscuit. Oh, biscuit. They're plain. Yeah. They don't have anything in them. Oh, underneath here. So no, no, no. Sneak one out. Oh, no. We want to see the hand. Actually, it's not even on the screen. Yeah. <laughs> Whose hand is that now? What's yeah. your name? Put down there. So what kind of pie do you do you make? Uh, all kinds. Saskatoon, <gasps> nice, 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 nice. Mine's a little bit. So, Dishwasher shopping oh, and pie and things. I'm everything shopping. Are you nice? Okay, let me try this out a bit. Got it. Oh, you want that one on? Okay. It was on, I just want to turn it down a little bit. Oh, okay. Yeah. So my mother has been cooking turkeys forever, Julie. Yes. And does a great job of them. So we take it out the day before. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. And then we cover it with a nice thick beach towel. Very technical. But it, yeah. works, it works great. Totally. And you know what? And in the morning, you had to take it out that day before. That's like, and she usually likes about a 20 to 25 pound turkey. Yeah. Week. And that's what we do. And then it's great. So awesome. Did you hear that? She puts it in a bin and covers it with a beach towel. Yeah. yeah. Very technical. Very technical. That's Alice's theme. Alice's. Yeah. And that's, you know, people you know have ways that they've yeah. done it for years and it works. Um, <laughs> the one, this turkey I bought yesterday was frozen solid. Mm -hmm. And I left it out. Until from like the middle of the day till dinner time, it's still like rock hard yeah. solid. Yeah. So I put it in a, yeah, in a big tub morning, right? full with filled with water, and yeah, and it was just uh, this morning, and it was still like ice cold. Oh, she said they were nice. Okay. The pie expert. So pumpkin pie, going in. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Oh, come on, come in and see. Yeah, it's going to be beautiful, isn't it? There's this, yeah. There's a duck on this side. Um, uh, turkey on that side. Yeah, feel free to look inside. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like a six and a half kilogram, so 15 pounder. And then you have to go and have to be at the top. <laughs> we got babies spitting up. Yeah. We got. Well, yeah, we got no. Oh. no, no, no. It's, it's okay. <laughs> okay. We should check our tricky. I'm gonna pull it out. Oh, oh it's so cute. Look at all the hair. Look at that hair. Wow. John. John. Okay, it's both are cute. Okay, I'm going to say hi to the baby. Uh, yeah, all grown dude. Yeah, he was born with a full head of hair. Really? Yeah. How old is he? He's born almost four months. That's a lot. I kind of feel like we should be turning the uh, laptop. <laughs> We're all like <gasps> cooing over him. Okay, let's check the turkey. We can do a mobile look, Julie. Tell me, this is gonna. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Can you see it? Tell me, I can't uh -huh. see it. You can see it. Yeah. I'm going to pull it out with tea towels, which is what I normally do. Oh, my God, come along. Mm -hmm. There we go. Nice. Wow, I'm the camera woman here now. I never, I mean, I never cover my turkey. Sometimes, I don't know, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Usually I don't. Um, and I don't baste it that often either. I mean, it's the sort of thing that, you know, you can, you can do or you can not do, and sometimes you don't even notice, notice the difference. I have one of those tricky basters at home, but let's just use a brush here. Huh? Got some nice drippings in the bottom of the pan. So this and this pan is perfect for making gravy, because a lot of um, a lot of roasting pans I just find too big and awkward and uh, and hard to maneuver. Because I put the pan right on the stove top to make the gravy, right? Is that what you do? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Use the roaster, whatever like it's a bigger roaster we have, and yep. then we just take and make it right in that roaster. Yeah. Or the pan. Yep. Yeah. Totally. Ooh, that looks I'm going to turn the oven down now. It looks a lot... Oh, smile, because I want a picture of you. Girl. I've got it before. Everything looks a bit paler on the screen. Or at least it does to me. Doesn't it to you? Does it? Oh, yeah. On the screen? On the screen, it looks paler. Like these biscuits, too. Look paler on the screen to me than they do in real life. Just FYI. I have to resist picking up the crispy bits, which are not quite crispy enough yeah. yet. Don't want to hurt yourself. No. Okay. Oh, it turned way down. Oh. Oh, I must have done that earlier. Yeah. I think I did that earlier when it was. Glad that wasn't here. Huh? No, it was smoking a little bit. One of the oh, the end was hanging over the side of the pan. Okay, check my. Okay, put it in biscuits, pie, duck. Oh, she flipped the duck. Turkey. Cranberry sauce, but you missed that part. What else? Gravy, we'll do the gravy at the end. It says we only have one viewer, but we really appreciate you. Okay. Biscuits. They're just plain, but there's butter. Biscuits and butter. Mm -hmm. work. Butter and biscuits. So those ovens bigger size wise, they don't have to Actually, this duck is probably close to being done by now. It's like an applause. <laughs> Lots of crispy bits in the bottom of the pan. Now, if we want to put some, let's put some potatoes around it, shall we? Because potatoes will then cook and duck that. Right? So we'll just put them right in. I usually do this about halfway through, so we've kind of missed the halfway mark, but that's okay. Tie it 
pass them around a bit and duck hat. If you have them, that maximizes the exterior surface area, maximizes the crunch factor. Ooh. Put me in here talking again. It's actually good. It's very Jamie Oliver ish. Remember when he first started and yeah. he talked to someone off the camera? Yeah. I'm just like Jamie Oliver. I, you very similar. Like, I, you know, consider it normal, down home, everyday kind of look, which is great. That's the uh, button coming out there again. Oh, is that just the. Oh, it shouldn't be. Oh, his little leg is burning. Uh, uh, the drip pan. Got it. Good eye. Toss these around in the duck fat. This is the most effective way of putting it. And dark roasting pans like this are great because they make your uh, they darken your veggies. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, if you have black baking sheets. She's getting one of those. Are you? Yes. Like cooking on the Yes. Yeah, they let me come in and <laughs> and try it out. Yeah. It? And it was very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Which one yeah. Did you pick the double? That, the, the, that white one over there. Yeah, the single. Um, with the gas top and no 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 oh, no no this, we're just talking away. That's the whole please, point of it. Please talk to us. It's um, it's gas on the top and electric oven. But I tried both and you couldn't tell the difference. Like I I made a batch of cookie dough and baked them in the gas and the electric here, and yeah. in here and you couldn't tell the difference between them, which is interesting. Thank you. But yeah, I like it a lot. It's hard to decide, hey? On an oven? Yeah. Are you doing not that setting up the size? I'm thinking about it, which I don't like. I'm not even at the stage of like whether oh. I'm going to like. Oh, really? I'm just in the middle of one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, thanks. I have no kitchen. Oh, thanks. All this time we've had no kitchen. We no, we're like, oh, soups. Okay, yeah. titles. We're doing a window with the kitchen, okay? With just plain kitchens. Combination. Oh no! No, we'll, we'll turn it. I don't think so. Thanks. Is it annoying? At dinner with Julie and Jerome. Oh, I know your blog. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah. And we have it also on the Jerome's Facebook page too. Okay. Yeah. So follow up with us. Yeah. Thank you. Commentary to see. Yes. Yeah. 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 This is Julie. Yeah. That's <laughs> yeah. Very nice. That's hard to face to the man. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. So we we always get nice to meet you. I was gonna say, yeah. what's your name? Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you, Rachel. I've been hiking up my pants. Blogging and Facebook and stuff for drums for a couple years. Every year at Thanksgiving and Christmas, I always post how to cook the turkey. People ask all the time. So now that we're with Julia, I said, she's like, like, what about if I come in and so we're doing the live stream? Yeah. Presently, we have five people watching. Yeah. Five awesome, awesome people. You gotta start somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, we're just trying to figure out how to do it. Do you see it coming up? Putting in a single pound new electric oven. Yeah, are you putting that one? Yes. Yeah, but it's tricky. Like we've got like an old window behind our. We have a 106 year old house, so we've got this old window behind the stove. So we have to get one built so that it'll go around it. Yeah. Yeah. They're beautiful. The white one. The white one. Yeah. 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 Oh, I know, me too. Yeah. Yeah. It is net in this size. I know. That's a lot of oven. It's got two. Yeah. One's gas, one's electric. I know. But this one, my kitchen is so small, it would never. Yeah. I couldn't fit as much oven with this. Oh, yeah. Like a lot of power. Yeah. Yeah. Like maybe the bedroom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's one that I chose. The white one. I like it. Like, well, I mean, obviously it's not in my kitchen yet, but but I've used it here a lot, and it it's nice. It's nice and even. It's at last. 
I think we're just going to wait for the uh, turkey and, and duck to be done now. And there's no window in the oven, so we can't put it on like the uh, like the Shah log. We can't put the, <laughs> the camera on the turkey as it roasts. Have the hand come in and baste it once in a while. <sighs> I kind of thought during the downtime we could talk, but we'll have to figure that out for next time. Cranberry sauce. One last thing for this weekend. In lieu of jam. Yeah, I know. I totally feels like I'm talking to myself. It looks like I'm so talking to myself. You have a taste too. test coming out pretty quick, or what? Yep. The duck is almost done. The turkey is an hour away. An hour and a bit. Maybe an hour. Then cranberry sauce on my biscuit. I have more frame. Okay, I need to get a post up for CBC. I think there's only one viewer right now. So I'm going to leave this going and you can just sort of watch the kitchen and, um, and I'll be back in like 10 minutes. And if it bursts into flame, then Cultural. Not done yet. Not done yet. No. Still running. So you'll see me coming.
Nice and crispy. Mm -hmm. Legs are wiggling in the joints, which means it's done. It's lots of sticky. Potatoes are done. Duck's ready. So duck is strictly dark meat, correct? Yeah, yeah, it's all dark. Yeah. This is Elaine. Hey, nice to meet you. Oh, I have seen you here before. Oh, yeah. I Elaine. Been, yeah. I have the Calvary Women in Construction group. Oh, yeah. Yeah, awesome. so we've been here before. Yeah. Well, awesome. How's your afternoon? Good. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, right. Should we eat it? One little bit. It's good. Oh, you made those too? Yeah. Oh, candy, candy. Yeah. Oh, I'll try them. <laughs> I went to get a serving plate and then I just didn't. What do you need? Nothing. Oh, yes. 
So now this streaming that you're doing, thank you. My hands in it. It's okay. Don't worry, we're gonna edit it. Oh, okay. So is it? So it's just yeah, yeah. It's just on all the time, and then you just edit. Yeah, like it. well, it's the first time we've done it. Yeah. Well, so really? what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have it edited for the cooking parts. But what you can do is like you can teach, and we were getting people to ask questions, but our questions they didn't quite work right. right. So you could be on there asking questions like, uh, how long did you do you turkey? How big should I buy a turkey? Which side of the duck goes up and down? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. So questions like that. So she talks, and then you have people monitoring and answering. Yeah. Then we're going to take the stream too and uh, edit it into our little things. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. that's it. Yeah. That's our So these are made from, from scratch? Yeah, you made those Holy oh, moly. I know. Oh, I use Pillsbury. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> Do you? No, I don't, I don't use it very often. Yeah. So, so you cook all over town? She was such a, um, thought I was saying. CBC. Well, I don't want to say too radio. Oh, wow. Okay. So I kind of do cook all over town. You do? Yeah. And well, not all quite like this, all but it. always, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah so on the fun. radio, what do you just, all of you just talk about stuff? Um, yeah, we pick a different subject every week and talk about it. Yeah. So, I'm invited to, to um, a women's, women's talk. Have you ever heard of Yeah, that was the lady that was at here. Mm -hmm. November, November, I think it was. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to November, I think it was. I'm going to go to November. 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 So it just keeps recording and then you add the new short. Yeah. Yeah. How long does it record for though? Eight, eight hours. Oh, okay. Yeah, isn't that crazy? It's for eight whole hours. So how do you like that range? I like it a lot. <clears throat> oh, here's a question. Because I remember one of your comments when you were doing cooking. Randy, how much is the blue one? The blue, blue one kind of so with that comment that and now having to use it, not a big deal. I think so. You can just open it up. Okay. So what's the question? Oh, oh sorry. That's not it. Somebody put in, it, it, it wouldn't look as nice, but could I get a faster or more even cooking if the turkey was cut into pieces and then cooked? Faster, for sure. Um, more even? 
I mean, anything cut into pieces will cook faster for sure. The other thing that you could do is um, is is smash conk it or butterfly it. So you take the bird, cut out the spine, and open it up like a book, and that will speed up the cooking process and make it more even because it's sort of an even thickness. No, but you can't stuff it. What's the question? Oh, no, it's a good question. Okay, there you go. Cooking faster. We have the defrost question. Okay, let me just check. Medium is here. Medium is here. Stuff it. Do you have to stuff it? No. It'll cook faster if you don't stuff it. Me too. But why would you? Can you it's the best part. Stuff it. This is good. Boil it? Oh, yeah. Can I microwave my turkey? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, he was. They didn't talk about this graphical stuff. I'm getting some. You know, Bill, he's there. No, he's there, right? If there's Bill, if he's there, he's back there. Oh, two people are watching now! Yay! Yay, wow. you two! Look! It smells like turkey in here. Oh, and pie! I said another pie! Mm -hmm. I was gonna say, what's the pie? Oh, yeah! Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ta-da! Ta-da! Hi. I have no idea how long that pie cooked for, but I would say about an hour. It should have been about an hour. So, turkey. So we should have a, um, a meat come over somewhere in the kitchen. Can you? There should be a meat thermometer somewhere. I just haven't looked for one oh, yet. Oh, yeah, that's a question. Um, but if not, you can tell by the way the, the legs wiggle in their sockets how, how far down it is. You can tell if usually if it was a chicken, if the juices run clear or not, but stuffed. Yes. It should need still a little bit more time. Yeah, if you poke the under, poke its armpits, you can tell it still needs a little bit more time. I'll, I'll take a look. I'll just lovingly baste it first okay. before I put it back in the oven. Stuffing is my favorite. Yeah, the stuffing is really that's gross. Whole bird is just a vehicle for stuffing. The pumpkin pie is a vehicle for whipped cream. You don't necessarily need to cover it. I don't cover it. You could. Just dry it out, keep it moisture. And that's it. I've never really had a problem with that, but um, you know, you butter and cover it. Just the oil itself. Just, just the oil and the turkey juices. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you could butter it. Um. And you could flip it, like start it upside down, and then flip it over, and that keeps the, the breast moist. Done. No, done. Yeah. 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 The only thing is, it's it's awkward to flip. You could use the top, like use yeah. the there's strings that you can you know put underneath or 
So usually it's Mike and I together with like two sets of two oven, mitts. Of oven mitts trying to flip it over and it it always looks, you know, not perfect at the end, but yeah. Do stuffing Let's you, do you, what do you call those stuffing bags? I find it soggy. Stuffing bags? Yeah. I personally don't like them. I don't the use them. bags? No, yeah. They're handy because they're yeah, so yeah, warm, out, but yeah. honestly, it's always, you never, there's never the crunchies. Yeah, no, no. No. no Unless you take it out in advance. Awkward, right? Maybe you take it out, spread it on a sheet and bake it. Mm. Then, but otherwise, I just find it soggy yeah. and bread. My first bite of stuffing of the season. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, I can. Yeah, just, so just see your hand. your hand. No one will be able to identify your your bangle. Wait a second. My, my hands in there the whole time. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. It's a crispy bits. I know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like. And I use my left hand. I will attest. Right. I love the turkey. The skin on the turkey. Mm -hmm. I was like, very little five. Like. Wait, okay, I'm gonna go look for a meat thermometer. I can't find one. I have well, in this whole kitchen, kitchen, they should have one. Yeah, there should be one back there. Yeah, there's a. Oh, it's still bloody out. Is it kind of like in pocket here? Oh, just, just, just I always kind of just slice it the leg. Yeah. It's that much blood, then, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've just never seen such a pocket of it before. Um. Anyway, yeah, you can see the juices are still pink. So now what do you do with a turkey when you're eating it? Oh, 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 it will be eaten. Oh, yeah. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Should take till about 5, and it is 4.15. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, our duck is done. I'm gonna put our duck out so you can see it. If you haven't seen it yet. I'm not sure who's coming and who's going. There we go. I've been a duck. Huh? I haven't had a duck in a long time. Yeah, no, I hadn't either. And then suddenly I just kinda did a whole bench. <gasps> Thank you. Okay, well, okay, you. Thank you for the tasting. That was one of the Thank you. Yeah, so I know the deck is good. Through, uh, we cooked it for longer than enough, and it's really okay. obvious that the, the legs are wiggling in the joints. Oh, yeah. get, There's no pink juices. Yeah, just few people, okay. It's good. Hi. But you'd want it to be about 165, 175. Hi. We're cooking a duck, duck. and a turkey. Yeah. Oh, wow. The turkey's still in the oven. The duck is, is finished. Rest and Getting people trying for Thanksgiving. Yeah, exactly. I can't believe it's this weekend. Either I know. I, I don't believe the time. No. Yeah. I know. It's crazy. So fast. I know. I try not to talk about that anymore. I didn't believe that when I was a kid. And I, I always, the thing that always bugs me now, I was when my parents were, when we were little, and your parents were like always asking each other how they slept. I'm like, why would you ask how you sleep? Like, no, when you're a kid. Sleep. No, but when you're a kid, well, oh, nowadays, like I'm always, you're always like asking, did you sleep okay? My kid's <laughs> up all the time, right? I'm like, oh, you know. But when you're a kid, you're always like, why do older people worry about sleep? So <laughs> how do I sleep? And when you're in 35 to 50, 60, and sleep is like. Listen, I remember when I was about 20 and about 30 with middle age. Oh, yeah. I'd like to go back to being 30. <laughs> oh, yeah. I remember thinking that too. Yeah. yeah. There's three people watching that. Yay! We're we're live streaming it on the internet. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah, we have three people watching, and now you're watching. And now four, or five, <laughs> five, six, and the hundreds of people Ooh. in this live studio. Yes. yes. Oh, there's an applause thing. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah. So I'm showing off my duck to the internet. And we'll leave the trick okay. a little bit longer. Okay. Should we put uh, this out on a platter and let everyone sure. attack it? Get a platter. Shall we, shall we get a platter by the royal we? Meaning yeah. you. We'll try to resist picking at all the crispy potatoes before we get it out there. There you go. Thank you. Yeah, nice. Did you find a big knife? Uh, there was, was yeah, there's some like red lines there. Look at the crispy foods. Oh, 
Oh, there's duck goo all over the bottom of the pan. So this is for the potatoes to get extra rolled around them. You could make gravy, but I'm make gravy with the turkey sauce. If I can find some stock. Huh? Look at all the crispy bits! Oh my gosh. If I ever have another child and they make crispy bits. <laughs> everyone loves crispy bits. You're gonna put it on the same platter or do you want Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Those are ambitious plates there. Well, <laughs> it was either small or I'm eating this one. Quality control is very important. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep this one too. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. potatoes. What we need now is a piece of bread to mop up the crispy bits, like this. Mm -hmm. Even the dishes at the back. Oh, we're down to... Oh, really? I know. You need to try it first. Well, there's enough for you to try with them. No, without her trying it. I don't know if it's a day or day. No. Yeah, she's still in line. We just go to the side. You can't see the audio. There you go. Well, did they hear that? Huh? Who? What? He's being bad. <laughs> That's awesome. How? Can't believe that. There's plates for this. Oh, we're looking at a full meal deal here? Or? I'll try a bit. As roasted potatoes. With the duck. Are you against that? Roasted potatoes? Yeah. Absolutely not. In duck fat? Duck fat? Well, they're roasted. The duck is the king of fat. I know. I love fats. Mm -hmm. I love fats. No, I do. Oh, it's beautiful. I guess you don't need to shut up, right? Make it easier. Slice it. So it's duck skin and a bit turkey. I love turkey skin. It's like chewing. I like turkey skin too. It's not as good as chicken skin. I don't know if they're all good. I'm an equally equal opportunity skin eater. Oh, yes. But look how when it's cooked, when it's cooked well, it's nice and thin. Yeah. <laughs> you got this for like. Sure, I'll have some potatoes. The leaning in. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yes, that's a good question. Here. 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 Oh. Oh, look at that one. Huh? Thank you. Dinner time, yes. Dinner Go ahead. Yeah. I like that just a little bit. Oh, I never tried before, so it's my first time. Mm. You're plugging me. I'm, I'm picking at your food. Other side. See it? I'll do it. I'm on my glasses. Nice. 
and we can have more if you like. Sure. Want some potatoes? Okay. Oh, that's tasty. Thanks, Elena. I tried these. Very good. Oh, good. I'll have to save some for Jerome. Yeah. The skin is thin and crispy. Mm -hmm. So, when I heard you on the radio this morning, mm -hmm. you actually poke the skin to allow the grease. Yeah, to let it to drip out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it gives it a crisper. Yeah. Do you do that with turkey too? No. no? Just duck is a lot fattier than turkey. But so. the skin wouldn't crisp up then? Or? Yeah, it just lets all the, like, there's a layer of fat under the skin and it lets the fat render. And that's render why the out. skin is thin. Fat out. Yeah, yeah. The layer of fat under the skin is, um, yeah. Do you want some more? No, I'm good. There's lots. It's very rich. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah, oh, you don't need much. Yeah, no. Sweet potatoes. Oh, oh, sure. Those are really good. Yeah. Okay. One person watching. I wonder if that's accurate or not. It's kind of tough. Went up to three and Oh. Are there questions? I, I, I just roast them here. Oh, okay. And the little fingers in the food. Did you cook those videos with that? Yeah, in the duck. Yeah. Put them in about halfway through. We have the pie. Okay, so here. The pie puffed up at first because of the eggs. Settle so back down. Done. So, do you have your own TV show then? No, I did for a while. Since it's in reruns. Yeah, they were actually seeing this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, you on there quite a bit on CBC? Yeah, every week. What day is it today? Every Tuesday. Every yeah. Tuesday? Yeah. Oh, do you? Oh, yeah. So, do you cook for them or you just strictly talk about it? Yeah, first piece of duck. I know. It's not bad, actually. No, it's much tastier than the turkey. Well, it's more flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You were saying ducks aren't defined, too, right? It's not as hard to find as it used to be. And co op has it now. The last few people that I, my brother in law, cooked ducks last week, and he got it at Coca Cola. So, yeah. Yeah, they have all fresh stuff now. See, what I would have done is. <clears throat> Peel that all that skin off. Eat the skin. Oh, I thought you meant cook it. I'm no, no, no. Okay. Just eat the skin. Oh. And then have the meat up. For whoever. Like so. my wife does it like. Oh, and then she cuts it with the skin on. Yeah. So a lot of people don't eat the skin. Yeah. All uh, right. Yeah. To me, that's crazy. Crazy people eat too. It's, oh, like yeah. it's like cooking a prime rib. Yeah. Just cut it's the outside piece off. Yeah, and yeah, take yeah. That. yeah. People don't like the outside. Those are crazy. So, how much would it cost to buy a turn at that like this size? That was about fourteen dollars. Yeah. Yeah. It feeds a lot of yeah because again you only you know, just yeah, like that's not yeah. for you. So rich. With vegetables. I'm a meat guy. Okay, I have to finish my, my um, CBC post. I just have to. You barbecue too? I barbecue. Yeah. Maybe we should make more barbecuing. Cook it in rice on barbecuing. 
The Kamado Joe's too. Oh, the Kamado Joe's too. So is it gonna be on our website? It will be probably not for a week or two. Okay. We'll probably put it together this now because okay. the editing will take quite a while. I'm asking you to do very Hi, Sue. We're at, Julie's just gone to do something. She'll be back. But look at the pie. This is the duck. And there's turkey pie. It's a lot richer than turkey. Thank you so much.
See my station break sign? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs>
Love this. Brilliant. Oh, my hair is all over the place. I love okay. this. That's awesome. Here you go. You can put, I even have a sponsor. And the biscuits you. are. Oh. <laughs> hey, you can get fancy now. now. What is. Oh, it's a catalog. Oh. Have you not mm -hmm. seen that? No. Oh, man. Uh, okay, so we're going to take the turkey out, but it's getting close to 5, which means I have to go because <laughs> I have an event at 6 and we're going to be home at 5.30. Oh. I know, but it was like noon. Oh, yeah, it's just fine. The turkey's done. We won't be able to do the gravy, but that's okay because only two people are watching. <laughs> Sorry. To, yeah, we'll do that later. Um, you know what you do? Film your growth gravy at do. Thanksgiving. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Totally. And then we'll put it on it. Um, hmm. what? What? If I took it, <laughs> you need I'll to do, you do a couple desserts for a segment. Are you sure? Oh, but I'll bring the hand back. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Taking it and I'm eating this. Okay, let's take the turkey out. Mm. 
What? <laughs> nice. And tons of drippings in the bottom of the pan. Just in time for dinner. All right. So I usually stick it in a few places, the sort of thickest part of the thigh. You don't want it to touch the bone though, because the bone conducts heat better than the meat. So, um, so if it touches the bone, it's sort of like giving you an inaccurate reading. So this is Celsius. It's 165. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to Google that. Oh, you'll have to go on this, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. I have no idea. Yeah, So it's 73. Someone yeah, someone's watching. Take the internal temperature of the stuffing, um, which is smart. But what I do is I scoop it out into a casserole dish and put it in the oven or in the microwave and just like zap it to heat it through. And because you can do that while the turkey is resting, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to let the turkey rest. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna put it on this. Stuff in 
vintage chocos tonight. Pardon me? Oh, try the potatoes. Hey! Would you believe in it? Uh huh. Oh, yeah, they put it in. Oh, thank you. No, I can use these or this. Thing. I think so. Right. Yeah. It's not gonna eat itself. Oh, perfect. Yeah, probably. Is that been? So look how nice and it's nice and moist, even though we didn't have stock. No, it's fairly dry going in, but now it's no, it's not. It's no. it's moist, but it's not mushy. No. That's what I really don't like. That'd be great for gravy. Right? One thing that you could do. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's great. There's great drippings in the bottom of the pan. Okay. So that's out. Now I can. That's quite a bunch of scriptures to make sure that the food is good. Whoops. Yeah. Yeah, you got to make sure the oven's work, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay, I'm just going to lift it. We always mess up all our dish towels when we do turkeys. Ta da! Let it rest. And then all these juices. What I usually do is pull, get, skim off the fat, use some of the fat to make a roux, equal parts fat and, and flour, um, and, and whisk it back into the drippings and then add a bit of extra stock. But we don't have any, um, we don't have any stock anyway, so I'll give you a container. Here, I'll, I'll take it. No, Jill, I can get a Bits, but you know what? I don't mind getting little chunks of crispy stuffing in my gravy. Oh, which? Oh, you did stop. Oh, oh good. Are you filming? Okay. Let's do it super quick. You good? You sure? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Turkey, uh, turkey goop, or duck goop. I think so. Do you want to keep the duck goop? You want the duck goop, don't you? Duck fat? Oh, yeah. we don't have enough at home. Okay. Okay, okay, so, so this no. is... No, just stop it. Thank you. Thank you. Very well. Sure. Mm -hmm. 
Let's get in quickly so we don't get lumps. If you whisk it into the fat, um, you won't get lumps. <laughs> Can you do that for me? Wow, this is like powerful. Mm. Okay, I can do that. Here we go, Julie. I'm going remote now. Here we go. You ready? Can you see? Can you see it? Can you see it? Until it's too bright. Oh, there we go. It says searching for a face. Oh. So you can see that it's starting to thicken up. If you want to add more flour, rather than sprinkle it in because that just bites lumps, mix it with some uh, some fat, some of the reserved turkey fat, or some cold butter. Or what did you say? Water? Cold butter? No, no that's that corn makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Cornstarch and cold water, um, flour and fat. Got it. Yeah. It's not as dark as usual, but you know, it all depends on the stock that you get. Sometimes you have a lot of really dark bits. You could add a little bit of soy sauce, sometimes people do for salt, and that ooh, makes it darker. Can you see your cup? A gravy boat. Hang on, I'm coming back. Gravy, a little pitcher. Don't worry, but I can pour it into a bowl. Yeah, pour it. Yeah. yeah. Here. Hang on, I gotta put your. Oh, it's easier. Okay. Perfect. Ooh. Hot. Hot. Because it just yeah. came out of the oven. Yeah. Uh, here. Maybe see this quick wipe up. Here. That's it. I know it's not exactly Jamie Oliver um, display. It says zero viewers, so. Oh, we're still filming because I'm going to use it. Ta da! Turkey. Yeah, so, you guys will eat this? Yep. Awesome. You're going to take some tea? No, no. no. We're signing off. Bye. Thanks, Julie. Thanks for uh, logging on. Happy Thanksgiving, Merry Thanksgiving. Christmas, all those great things. <laughs> Hanukkah. Yeah. Oh, it's five of that. Do they have turkey at Hanukkah?